<sighs> right there, right there, building notions of right doing and wrong doing, there is a field. I meet you there. Right there, beyond the notions of right doing and wrong doing, there is a field. I meet you there. We are facing as humanity, as human societies, like a major challenge. And I'm not sure about your culture, where you come from, but where I come from, when you think about shifting, transforming a major challenge, we are always talking about like hard work, sacerdocy, or marching, striking, or even fighting. You know, but what if, what if building the world of our dreams could be fast, free, fun, and fantastic? What if building the world of our dreams could be fast, free, f like a big adventure? Like in my country, so I come from Brazil, so probably many of you, you know about the carnival, a lot of energy in the carnival, but what you, what you don't know is that we have a very nice cultural game, community game, it's called Gincana. Gincana is a game that the whole town, a whole city come together to play silly, impossible missions. For example, when I was 12 years old, I played my first Gincana, the whole town is there, like grandmas, father, mother, kids, all, everybody plays together, and the guys came to the stage, the organizer said, okay, guys, you have three hours to bring a real pink elephant. Those kind of silly possible missions. So there's no elephant in Brazil. I don't know if you know about that, but there's no elephant in Brazil, right? But there's no pink elephant anywhere. But people don't care. So the organizers, you have to figure out, like, how can I, I provide the impossible mission? So the guys got that pink elephant. But then when they say, like, you have three hours, the whole town is like, like you know, like, even the mothers, they kick the kids, like, don't, don't stop me, like, you know? They're ready to run. I cannot tell the whole story, but believe me, after three hours, there were two elephants. <laughs> One gray. So they found the circus. Someone said, circus, they found, you know? And another gray elephant, but the team, they paint the elephant pink, you know? <laughs> because people say, we don't care, like, you know, it's a real elephant, it's pink, nobody told you could not paint. But those kind of silly things that the whole country play together. So when I realize how hard is our mission to try to restore our biosphere, or to, have to build a better planet for our kids, I said, okay, I'm not gonna fight it. People are not gonna join me. But what if I could create a global gincana to mobilize two billion people to play? Edgar, what you're talking about, you're in so cap, like, you know, don't be stupid, like, we are serious people. So, is, is that okay if I bring a little bit of my culture here? I can, okay, okay, okay. So, for, for a few minutes, just, just forget about where you come from. Now you're in Brazil, okay? And then you go back again, okay. Okay, let's give a, so, a little bit of a try. Okay, how many of you, if you believe you deserve to live in a better planet, please stand up or make yourself like visible. If you cannot stand up, just, you know, okay? If you, if you live in a, in a, a nice planet already, just stay, stay sit down, okay? You're there, okay, enough. Nice, stay there. But it's not just enough for you to say, okay, I want to live in a better planet. We need people that are committed with, another, with a beautiful planet. If you believe that you have any quality or any resource that you'd naturally give to support this planet, just raise, stand your right hand. Nice, good. So, pay attention how many people around you, like, look around and give it a little bit wave. You're not alone in this task, like, raise your hand, raise your hand, stay there. Okay, but these people, you have so much resource or connections that just these people, you could shift San Francisco. We are talking about the planet, right? So, with your right hand, stay there, with your right hand, find someone, another person close to you that's wearing any dark clothes and touch them. Touch them, like, and stay there, stay there. Touch the sort of right, right hand, find someone else, like, and touch this person. So I forgot, I forgot to tell you that the name of this game is Touch Glue. <laughs> Whenever you touch, you stick there. Look for someone. Touch the person, yeah. Everybody, yeah, stay there. Right, touch and glue, stay there, don't you? If you're not lying, if you're not lying, 
there's a double of people here you know, that wants to change the world. But we need more people, because this can play maybe shift to California, but we need more. So with your left hand, stay there with your right hand, left hand. Think about a person that is not here, that is very smart. I know that you're cool, but I need like smart people to really save the planet, right? It's not enough, we want you, whatever. Your left hand, think about that person that you know is not here, but you know that if you call them, they're gonna join you, right? Just if you make sure. With your left hand, find another person close to you that is still not touching, that have a, a, a clear, a light style, light clothes, and touch them. Fine. Not gonna be easy. You're not gonna be easy, a light person. Let's find them. Find them with any piece of clothes. Any piece of clothes. Are you okay? I, all, I got it. You're doing good, good. Okay, nice. If you're not lying, there's a triple of entrepreneurs here. We can move the United States with the power and resource that we have, right? But we still talk about the planet. You have great actions, your hands are committed, but we need some base, sustainability, right? With your right feet, <laughs> ah, your right feet, think about another friend of you that's very well connected, a popular friend. You know that if we bring this friend of you, they're gonna bring at least 20 people. Very well connected, right? We all have it, right? Think about this friend. I'm gonna find some people around you that is still not touching, <laughs> that has straight hair. Anyone? Close to you, find your way. Find your way, straight hair. Touch and glue, don't touch and glue. Right, nice, nice. If you're not lying again, you have so many smart people then you can start to influence other continents, right? But you're still missing some resource. With your left feet, uh, I'm the boss. Your left feet, you're gonna think about another friend that you have that is very influential, like, uh, like, a, like a, a, a TikTok influencer, or a very powerful singer, someone that's very famous, that can bring at least one million people. We know, yeah, you're powerful, you know that people. Don't people that can connect with them say like, come to the, join the movement. Let's bring many million people to this movement, right? So with your left foot, you're going to find any and a fourth person that is still not touching. Find. Find a way. With your left foot, go. You find a way. I said it fast, free, fun, fantastic. Not easy. Go ahead. You got it? Okay, statue. Stop. We still have some resource. Oh, you need to bring your brain, your intelligence. Now is the time. So now, look for the closest shoulder close to you and go there with the cozy and put your, put your, go. It's a Brazilian game. Go. Find your shoulder. Yeah. Look at that. Go, 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 go. Go. Yeah, yeah. I got to count two, three. When I say three, we all got to give three little jumps in a back mortal. Okay, come back. <laughs> come back. You can sit now. Look, look, look. I don't have time. How much time? Ah, he's, uh, look, I, I, maybe it's not easy to do it here. Usually I do it in the audience. I ask, pay attention what kind of sensations are alive in you right now. What kind of sensation is alive in you right now? We don't have microphones here, but usually it's always the same. Oh, in the, uh, joy. Good, good. Yeah, you can stream. Joy, community. community, energy, what? Affordability, that's nice, amazing, fun. fun. So you got it, right? Excitement, fun, people everywhere, all around the world, it is the same, not just Brazilian. Like, rarely some people say like, pain, <laughs> right? <laughs> it's stretch, but most of people say like, joy, excitement, community, connection, whatever. Can I, can I say that what we just did is a game? Yeah, it's a game. If, if it's a game, who won the game? We. Everybody. No, so is it possible a game where everybody wins? So you're saying that. Indigenous people in my land, they used to say, as if as in the game, as if as in life. As if as in life, as if as in the game which means 
When things are tough or hard in real life, they come together to play. Because in the fields of play, you can see what's going on and what you want to fix. But doing it together. So for them, whatever happens into the game, you can apply in the real life. It's real there. And whatever happened there, you're going to appear in the game. So did I make the game easier and easier and easier for you? No. I did harder and harder and harder, right? So why I did harder, harder and harder, and you were laughing more, more and more? <laughs> Do you like to suffer? You know, something happened in the fields of play. In the fields of play, people say that we have an ordinary version. Everyone, all of us, we have an ordinary version. Not a bad version. It's a day-by-day -day life version. And we have an extraordinary version. All of us. Right? If we really need to make major change, we better be in our extraordinary version. But not just that. Collectively, in our extraordinary version. And indigenous people in my land, they used to say, the only way to do that is not by inviting people for suffering, not by inviting people for sacrificing, marching, striking, or fight. Most of us may be ready to fight. We're not going to invite our kids to do that, our grandma to do that. But if you can invite them to play, many people will come. How can we design strategies invitations that can create a huge a global commotion. I'm sure, I'm pretty much sure that the government's not going to do the change that we need. Companies and enterprises are not going to do the change that we need. They are trying. They're not going to do that. Even us, the best social capital people investors, we're not getting there. We are missing, we are losing the war for that. But we can invite the whole society, the whole humanity that are eager to participate. They can join us and they can do that. How can we come together and create a global commotion to make the change that we are all looking for? A global commotion. And they say that if you invite people for, to play, to a party, to an epic journey, epic mission, you can do that. So I decided to mobilize 2 billion people and invite especially kids and teenagers to lead this game of mobilizing the whole society, a big touch and glue in the whole society to make the change that we are looking for. I have an amazing friend from Boston, Deborah Fries. Maybe you, some of you may know because she's a, a social investor, a uh, capital investor, uh, Deborah Fries. And she used to say, Edgar, I got it. We better play, otherwise, we're going to have to fight or to work hard. That's invitation. So please, very, very briefly, look to your left, left side or right side in this way. Left side behind you and in front of you. Did you see everybody? So I'm still in Brazilian mode, right? But I'm not allowed to leave the, the stage without each of you giving four hugs. <laughs> Go, right now. Four hugs, welcome to the social capital. Impact of trust. Hug one side. Say welcome, the other side. It's so good to be here. Nice. I'm so happy that you came. Yeah, good, good, good. Yeah. I said four. I said four. No more Brazil. Bye. See you soon. <laughs>